moments. But first, we have to check in with Lindy to see what she is doing for crafts for maybe her boyfriend. Yeah. We are here again at Michael's Crafts with Kate Allwright, craft expert here. And so our second craft we're going to make is very cool. Make your kid extra popular in class. What are we going to do? We're going to make a little post box for all those Valentine's cards that friends share on the day. Because normally kids just have little decorated envelopes or something. So if a kid comes to class with this, the teacher's going to think they're extra crafty. They are. They're going to know <laughs> that they've been shopping at Michael's <laughs> for some fun things. Extra crafty. They are. They're going to know that they've been shopping at Michael's <laughs> for some fun things. Little do they know, Mama helped. <laughs> Mom can always help. Right. Um, okay, so how do we get started? Okay, so Michael's has these wonderful little craft boxes, and we're using duct tape, which is a great medium for covering all sorts of things. Right. And what I've done is I've pre-taped it here, but I'll show you how to do it. Because duct tape now isn't just stuff you see on the red-green show. It's actually decorative, it's colorful. There are so many variations, and I've just got white, little pink polka dots, and some red duct tape, and you can have some fun with it. Awesome. More girly, more boys. <laughs> and it sticks to anything, right, is it the idea? It literally sticks to anything. Awesome. So it's a no-mess craft. Okay. We're going to just do a little decoration around, around the box, okay. and you can use paint pens to decorate the duct tape. Oh, wow. So we've got all sorts of different um, decorations for Valentine's Day. Super simple, right? Super simple. Just, you know, even little hands can do this. And you don't have to be super creative. This is just kind of simple. Just a stripe. And the creativity, I think, comes with the decorations. Right. And that's where the personalization goes. So you would put the little tape around it which gives us a nice band. And to cover the lid, I'm just going to start the one lid, and then I'll show you here. OK. Um, so just again, duct tape. Just duct tape. <laughs> Phoenix, even you, it looks like you could make this. <laughs> it's not just for fixing hardware anymore. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> and you just, oops, you just want to cut it. Mum might need to help little hands here. Right. And you just tuck it and fold it. So there's actually not even any gluing here. Very simple. Until the lid is covered, and of course, your child can choose their own color. Okay. I'm going to take the one that's already taped up. Oh, pre-planning. Pre now we need. Now we can decorate it how we like. Okay. And I've taken a paint pen, which will write on this shiny surface, and just done a little lace pattern all the way around, which you can continue. Child, give these to your child and let them draw their own name, their Very fun pretty. things. And of course, you, Valentine's Decorate would be with nothing that. without hearts. Right. So maybe we will uh, stay with us because we'll finish this box and show you how to do that. Coming up, also Saga. Have, do you know who Saga is, rock band? I've heard of them. <laughs> so they're an Ontario-based rock band. They rose to fame in the 80s with hits like Wind Him Up, The Flyer, and On The Loose. And uh, you can win your tickets here on Trending. So stay with us because I'll tell you exactly how to do that. And then we are going to just prepare this box and uh, show you how to finish this coming up. Thanks. Thanks, Lindy. <laughs> All right.